Issue 26 is a renewal levy that will fund Imagination Station's operating costs. The Children's Museum needs just over $1.1 million to remain open. The levy will cost Lucas County residents $5.21 per person annually. Imagination Station receives 41% of their overall revenues from public funding. Imagination Station's communications and PR manager, Anna Colon, says they applied for the renewal a year early because election years usually have higher voter turnout. Uh, if the levy doesn't pass in 2012, it gives us an opportunity to kind of regroup and identify what it is that the community is really seeking and it'll allow us for the opportunity to be able to run again in 2013. Critics of the levy do not question that the Science Museum is good for Toledo, but argue that taxpayers may have other priorities. Former Lucas County Commissioner Maggie Thurber believes voters should vote no on every issue on Tuesday's ballot. One of her complaints about Issue 26 is that the museum is a nonprofit organization. It's one of the only nonprofit entities in the entire state that can actually put a levy on the ballot and ask for taxpayer funds through the ballot. The two sides are in a stalemate over which decision is best for Toledoans. While Lucas County may be split on Issue 26, both sides can agree with Hillsdale Academy science teacher Judy Murray that Imagination Station is a unique place. It is nice to have some place to go where you can have so much more and you can do so many more experiments and demonstrations. So thank you Imagination Station. This is just a fantastic place to bring a school group. If Issue 26 fails to pass during this election, then the Imagination Station will have to come up with a different method to sway Lucas County voters to their side and avoid ending up like COSI. For UT10 News, I'm Sean Downs at the Imagination Station.